Thank you for signing up the Remedy Force 30 day trial. This video outlines a simple use case that will help you learn how to navigate the Remedy Force IT service management system. The use case is not designed to cover the entire Remedy Force solution. However, it's designed to help you gain a quick understanding of how users can navigate through Remedy Force and use the solution to enter and access information. To get started with this use case and to access linked information with complete details on the trial experience, the first thing you should do is to get acquainted with this linked information, which is available on the Home tab. From here you can have direct access to additional in-depth Remedy Force information, including videos, installation guides, release notes, and other complete user guides for all functions available in Remedy Force. Now let's have a look at self-service for submitting incidents and service requests. From the right-hand side of Remedy Force, click down the arrow button and choose Remedy Force self-service. The self-service module is commonly accessed and used by employees or business users of the company from a direct login. But for simplicity, we have this as part of a single administrator logon, so you don't have to log out and log in of the application. To create a new incident or request, click the Submit a Ticket button. For this use case, enter Having an issue with accessing corporate email in the Describe your issues box. And in the Category field, choose Email. Click Submit. These self-service forms are entirely configurable by your businesses. You will receive confirmation that the incident has been submitted. Let's now see how we manage incidents and requests. For this portion of the use case, we will access the incident queue. The Remedy Force console is the area where IT staff would access the incidents and requests assigned to them and perform common functions to solve incidents or fulfill service requests. From the Remedy Force console, at the top of the list, you will see the incident you submitted via self-service. All column headers are adjustable and views can be personalized. To see the details of the new record you created, click the incident number. A new form will appear with all the incident details entered via self-service. From the incidents or request forms, the agent will view information about the incidents, requests, enter additional details, see assigned tasks, access knowledge management articles to help solve the incidents or perform other steps in the IT process you defined. For the next step in this use case, we will assign a configuration item to the incident. Scroll towards the bottom of the form and click the search icon of the configuration item field. In the search filter by field, type email and hit search. In the search results, click email to link the email service configuration item to the newly created incidents as this is the service the agent requires to be associated with the incident. From the main incident screen, at the top of the incident form, click the save button. Remedy Force helps customers manage all their configuration items, assets and services. These items can be manually imported to Remedy Force or through integrated discovery tools. And assets or services can be automatically pushed into Remedy Force to create configuration items and their dependencies. To continue the use case, in the Agent Tools button at the top of the incident form, choose CI Explorer. Please note to turn off pop-up blockers as this action will open a new web form. A new form will appear focused on the email configuration item. This is a configuration item explorer that shows all the items linked to a CI. For simplicity of the use case, notice there is a change request previously linked to the corporate email service. Click the change request record ending in 004. A new change record form will appear. Change management tracks, controls and reports on the process of IT change management with workflow based on your business requirements. This is a pre-planned change request for corporate email. On the upper hand side of the form, click the related list button to review further details of this change request. On this screen, please notice Chatter is accessible via change record. Chatter functionality allows agents to collaborate to solve incidents, be notified of an approved change request along with a host of the other IT and non-IT based collaboration use cases. Staff can follow any Remedy Force object in order to gain collective knowledge and Chatter enables collaboration between IT and business as well. In the Chatter field where it's defaulted to write something, type corporate email will be down this weekend. Please close out of email before leaving on Friday and click share. To finish this use case, from the tabs at the top of the screen, click the Chatter tab. 
Within the chatter feed, notice there is a new post to the user community about corporate email will be down this weekend. Chatter is a great collaboration tool to share information and knowledge amongst the company, as well as the support of all types of business services.